Hey guys, so this is two minutes on why it's better to use a lift when we're moving around the deceased to get them in their caskets. Just a little example of why it is easier. And I thought of this earlier today, so hopefully it makes sense. Some people like to break their backs and just lift people into the caskets themselves with one or two people. But I wanna show you why with the deceased, it's much harder to lift someone, even a child, when you're putting them in. So think about this. When you lift somebody up, typically they are one, when they're living, they are one, they're kind of helping you. They may put their arm around your neck and two, their bodies bend to contour to your arms. So just stay loose, loose, not st just loose, like normal. No, like normal. So see, it's much easier when the weight is distributed in that form than it is when it, there is a, a person is deceased and especially after they've been embalmed, they're pretty rigid, which means they're straight. So now stay straight. <laughs> Um, so, it's even hard. So you have a lot of weight then hanging off this way and this way. Oh, it's a lot. The person is a lot heavier because there, it's almost like a pendulum that's going to hang and swing one way or the other rather than contoured in a smaller area that you can lift. So when someone is trying to lift a deceased over into a casket, they're out long and straight typically. Much, much harder. That is why we use a lift that puts three straps under the person, lifts them up and places them in the casket. There are those that are always gonna try and break their back when doing it by themselves or with another person, but I like to use a lift. Save my back. Thanks, guys.